Hi, it's Ian from Las Vegas Scooters and Lifts. Just a quick update. We've uh, sold the three wheel traveler plus the blue one that I reconditioned in one of my videos. So we sold the Blue Traveler Plus I reconditioned a couple of days ago. That video should be uh, up on YouTube hopefully. But yeah, I've, uh, I'm going to need to put another one on the showroom floor until we get some scooters in from Pride. They're still suffering with uh, delivery problems. So uh, yeah, there's at least a three month uh, pre-order wait for any, any scooters. We've actually uh, just managed to get four traveler pluses to come in but no three wheels so if some people want a lighter three wheel then they do a four wheel but uh, yeah i've got uh, another recondition to do this one's going to be a bit more in depth with more parts it's uh, quite uh, an older scooter but it does run good but there are some bits of damage on the scooter that i'm going to have to replace so some parts so it's going to be a bit more expensive for us but if we can try and recondition it and make it look good so i'll show you the scooter now it's uh, this poor little thing here this is version one so it's uh, missing me a shroud there that one's okay now the tip wheels are okay just dirty again dusty people don't clean these they just leave them in the garage they don't want to deal with them and it's of course version one had the the uh, cream wheels or grey wheels and uh, i'm going to change these out for black to make it look a bit newer i haven't looked at the transaxle but it sounds good there's uh, doesn't look like there's any lateral lateral movement on it so it sounds good the brake brake handle looks brand new just a bit plastic on there uh, that looks good no brakes on this rear shroud so i'm going to have to replace that and that's all good just a dusty that'll clean up okay you can always tell it's an older version the, the logos are gold they're now different they're silver now yeah i'll replace this uh, handle obviously somebody cut it with a grinder or some sort but i'll replace this i haven't got a pack put on there but I will re replace it that's actually a new logo so this may have been a new battery pack or a replacement pack a bit of a mark there where they've drilled it for some reason and this is the floor shroud that's broken so that'll have to be replaced the front wheel cover shroud okay that's not uh, duct taped or or broken but this version one as well you can tell it's got this cut out for the colored side panels I do have some of those but they won't have that panel anymore so it's no point I'll just put a new one on there to make it look uh, like a new scooter get away with these because they get falling off so that's that uh, front wheel will go I'll put a new uh, new style front wheel on there yep three wheels okay front side just wants cleaning whole thing wants cleaning really it's uh, pretty grimy it's coffee and all sorts but yeah the front basket that I'll get to uh, changed out this is for the old wire basket ones they don't make those anymore so I'll have to change that bracket put a new br basket on there um, I think probably a bit of tape on there that they just to hold this down who knows to respray them I'll respray them I do have some extra panels that I can pump through but uh, I may change this dial up on the analog I do like the analogs better than the digital but people like the digital ones and that's been sat for a couple of months the horn doesn't work so cheese a little bit bent it's not too bad speed dial works throttle works it's a little bit of wear on the uh, handlebars I may change that I don't know yeah, it's going to be a bit more in depth with buying parts for this three wheels new tiller new basket new floor shroud new battery handle ah 
missing one big thing. Seat. Ha <laughs> ha, look what I found. I found a seat. This was off a uh, four-wheel Traveller Plus. So I'm not going to uh, recondition the four-wheel Traveller Plus as yet. That one is also a version one of the four-wheel Traveller Plus. It's got grey wheels. But, uh, yeah, this seat will be better on this, better suited on this scooter because I've got four-wheel Traveller Pluses coming in. I actually discontinued this scooter now, which is an absolute pity because this was a great mid-range scooter and also a mid-sized scooter because you have the Traveller, which is the smaller one there. It has a smaller football, smaller width, as you can see. You've got a width there of about two fingers. This one, you've got about three fingers there. You've got like three or four fingers there. A lot wider, a lot longer. Better transaxle, bigger transaxle, a bit wider, a little bit faster. That does four miles an hour. This does 4.3, 4.4 miles an hour. Got a longer range than the smaller Traveller. You can get bigger batteries for that, but yeah, this one's uh, faster and yeah, this one will go a bit further. It's got a better transaxle in my mind. In my, my humble opinion. But yeah. Uh, at least I've got a seat, just a charger, basket, front shroud, wheels, tyres, clean up. Top console needs to sort it out. So, yeah, got another one to do. Get it on the left and start stripping it now. to the uh, the Traveller Plus I've uh, stripped it all down down to bare bones uh, I'm gonna get it cleaned up I've got those soaking overnight just clean some of that gump off of there that'll rinse off okay uh, there's my top cons bit of a mess in here at the minute I got uh, a lot of work yesterday but, um, Long time customer, long time customers. Um, Tom and uh, Carol came in. We've known them for many years. Yeah, one of our first customers. They came in with they uh, they had a Pride backpacker internal lift in their vehicle that they bought. They came in for a new battery. So I told Carol, and then he broke the charger wire. So he came back again, and I fixed that for him. So oh, yeah, I'll get to uh, finish cleaning and stripping and soaking this and get that on soak. And I could strip this down. I just want to know uh, what colour I want to paint these shrouds. So, uh, I can send those over to Drew. He's painting some silver today, so that may be uh, a good idea to do them some kind of candy colour. I don't know, let me... Uh, let me know in the comments, I guess, but I'll probably spray them by the time anybody uh, gets to comment on this video. So, But you never know. It may take me a while to do, because I've got to wait for parts. So I may do this in the two-part section to uh, cut down the length of the video, because I tend to uh, talk a little bit. But yeah, I've got a list of parts, I think, somewhere that I need. So, yeah. This is my list of parts. What have I got? So I definitely need, I need to order me a floor shroud, front wheel, back wheels, front basket I've got, tiller I've got. I'm going to see if I can rejuvenate that so I don't need that. I don't see anything else that I need to order. Well, in fact, actually, I'll probably cut this video here. And... Uh, I don't, oh, I've got a service coming in tomorrow, today, tomorrow. I see new Revo 2.0. lady just wants it servicing, checking out, make sure everything's tight. 
So uh, look out for that video. For this video, it's uh, this will be part one, just to tear down, and then I'll do the the cleaning and uh, order the parts. And when they come in, I'll do the reassembly as well. So, but yeah, stay tuned for this one. Thanks for watching. See you later.